So uh, Radtech, uh, we have I'll a theory. We have a theory about why you couldn't come up. This um Let's take a fat dab real quick. I'll go over here. Of course. Of yeah. course. Hey, Rat Dick, can you settle for a medium large dab? <laughs> I really want a more lucid Rat Dick today on the show. No, this is not too bad. It's like a half, that's yeah. like a quarter gram dab. Just, it uh, looks like he's got a little instrument. It's, I don't know what, it looks sort of like something you would put under your nails in order to clean out the gunk. Yeah. And on that little point that he drops into the bowl of the pipe is the biggest possible dab that could be supported by that little surface. Right. It's, it's, you know how ants can carry like a thousand times their body weight? Yeah. That's how big the dab is on this little instrument he has. Yeah. He just blew so much dab smoke into your face. You're all going to be high by the end He of always does that, too. We he always never do get high at the, by the end of this thing. <laughs> the, the, um, it does, it is like a science experiment, uh, the dab rig. It's, it's, it's like uh, something you do in chemistry class in high school. Right, Tick, blow the dabs outside. I always ask you that. <laughs> you can handle it, Danny. I know. You can handle it. No, I don't want it. You can handle it. Get, you can second. see it on the camera. Don't get a stone, bro. You're good. Dan, dog. Right, Dick, you got to blow it outside next time. I'll give you one today. I'll give you one. And then, uh, and then get that number dialed in. The oh, other one. Okay, yeah, yeah. Get a dial, then don't call it quite don't yet. Don't call it quite yet. <laughs> so, Rat Dick. Ratty. All right, so. so that was big dab. You confirmed that was big dab, right, Dan? What's that? Yeah, that was big dab, right? Big dab. It was dog. a fat dab, okay? I sit. I don't, I'm no longer impressed by your ability to take a fat dab, right, Dick? You've been doing it since the day I saw you three years ago. <laughs> I looked a lot different three years ago, didn't I? A lot younger? Yeah, yeah. Well, you're three years younger. Yeah, three years younger. You can hear that. My friend, he's, uh, he watched that video for the first time. Well, not for the first time. He watched that video. You want to talk into the mic, buddy? Yeah. 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 He watched the old Rat Dick video, and he was like, yo, you look so younger back then. I was like, yo, you're actually kind of right. I look, I look back, I'm like, yo. Were you insulted when your friend said that? No, I, no, I mean, I, no, it's not a bad thing to get, grow up or get old, you know? It's uh, okay. Have you grown up, Rat Dick? Have you changed? I'm growing up, bro. I'm a big Rat Dick now. Uh, I've got a big Rat Dick. Uh -huh. <laughs> I, I think, wish uh, you guys, you will confirm. You've seen it. I think you just awesome. lost a little. I mean, you just gained weight, maybe no, right? Or, or do you really? I don't think you look that much older. Uh, maybe I get gaining a little bit of weight. It's probably I think what that's it is. all. It yeah, is. but you don't I look bad. Shaved. I still I think shaved. right now you look yeah. the best you've ever looked. Thank you. So it's that's not bad true. to get a little, get a little husky and shit. Men you know? get fucking better as yeah. we age. You know what I mean? Not Can't. fat or anything. You know? Right, no, you're you, not fat. Do you yeah. find yourself becoming more attractive yeah. to women because your knowledge of, say, current events is expanding? Oh, yeah, I, I know you've been reading. Well, let's talk yeah. one at a time, right, Dick? One at a time. <laughs> but <laughs> you're still your conversational manners are still developing. But <laughs> do you feel like you have more? To, I, I assume your net worth now is somewhere near a hundred thousand dollars. Do you feel like your worth to women has grown a lot since that first video? Oh yeah, man. It's, uh, my worth is my rat dick worth is getting bigger. Yeah, let's go, dude. <laughs> yeah, and Ratic, Leo, and I—I I think Leo was the first one to float this theory. Yeah. We, we were trying to get Ratic up to San Francisco to film with us. The idea was we were going to have Ratic dressed as a 1920s convict. Right. That's <laughs> black and white horizontal stripes, not the orange jumpsuit. Mm -hmm. Leo and I are going to be dressed as prison guards. We were going to take him to Alcatraz Island get him absolutely loaded on LSD. If you were willing to do I it, I thought we were going to do it next weekend because I couldn't get up there. No. no. Unfortunately, we I had... I was so down to do this idea. Well, we took Nico. We got Nico yeah, hammered. I saw, we did the I same idea was, um, with a drunk Nico. His Instagram story, I saw that picture, and Nico looked fire. Yeah, well, Nico looked good. Looked it would have been fire if you were on a bunch of shrooms or acid. Well, we could use that concept in the future. We can. In the future, we can. yeah. We even got another video idea for you uh, that we're going to do soon, too, that's going to be absolutely amazing. But, Rajik, you don't have... Snowboarding and mammoth? It's gonna it's gonna be in the desert. <laughs> but Rattic, desert. you don't okay. have an ID though, so you can't get on a plane, which would be the easiest thing. I just would have bought you a plane ticket. Yeah, yeah. You get up there. you I don't know why you maybe the government took away your right to operate a motor vehicle. You can't <laughs> drive, right? Uh, I I don't have a driver's license. I lost it and everything. As okay. I was speeding on the beach, I didn't pay my court uh, ticket. Did you crash into that sign? Remember that legendary video of fans? No, said? that wasn't his. I, I, I mean, guess that was. Even was yeah. I wish I had an uh, Audi. <laughs> that was funny. Yeah. That would have been even. That would have yeah. been really funny if you had crashed into that Dude, sign. Dude, that was, that was a fire car, bro. But mm -hmm. Ratik, he couldn't drive himself. He couldn't get on any form of public transportation. We tried to get him on a train. And he kept tripping out about the terrain. <laughs> you kept tripping out about Alcatraz because you thought there were active prison guards <laughs> looking to detain people on yeah. the island. Yeah, I thought I thought it was like a, like a slave catcher situation. You had the slave catchers out there getting sure. all the black people. Sure, oh. yeah, that's, that's exactly <laughs> what round them up, boys. So, <laughs> so, so, but yeah. Leo floated the theory that. Uh -huh. Well, do you remember your theory, Leo? My theory is that is if you can't hit a fat dab, 
like once an hour at the top of the hour, is it a problem to, to travel? Like if you were on a train and you can't yeah. hit a dab for like four hours. That, that, yeah, I was I was kind of worried about that traveling. And what would happen? Smoke. What would happen if you can't hit a dab? <laughs> I could, and it's, Leo, just, you're being so generous with the hour thing. Mm, it's I know. Once it's, every 15 minutes. Yeah. Right, Ratic? It's yeah, closer to yeah. once every 15 minutes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's uh, um, yeah, I dab pretty hard. Uh, once every like twenty, thirty minutes, I'll take one. I, I've even dabbing at work too. Dabbing at work, taking taking dabs. At work, work. I mean, <laughs> in the middle of your studio apartment. Yeah, because yeah, you home. work from home in the yeah. middle of, middle of your might, studio. You might be like, oh, you, work, you take right, dabs. Right, it'd be good office. if you had some headphones so we don't talk over <laughs> Should each other. I take put some yeah, put some headphones. Put those on there. My there bad we go. boys. I haven't. Yeah, we just gotta talk one at a time, Rat I can hear your voice now. Okay, cool, cool. Okay. So, Rat is that part of it? You didn't want to be in somebody else's car or on a train. What would happen if you're on an eight-hour train ride and you can't rip fat dabs? So let me tell you, uh, I wanted to, uh, I told you guys, I was like, if I'm going to go, the person who does drive me is Van Jerry, and we have to smoke DMT along the way. Mm-hmm. He has to tattoo my gooch this time. <laughs> I mean, that was a great idea. Yeah, that was a great idea. Van Jerry, unfortunately, he said no to that. I don't know why. And, you know? and Iggy said uh, no, too. I can't, yeah, why? I can't <laughs> understand why Iggy would have. He's he uh, holding on to the past. <laughs>